What's up Trophy Hunter? Hello and welcome to the 10 easiest AAA Platinums of 2018. A short explanation what means AAA. AAA is an informal classification used for video games produced and distributed by a mid-sized or major publisher typically having higher development and marketing budgets. More budget means more gameplay so don't expect a fast platinum here. Instead of this you can expect a lot of fun with these titles. And the platinum is also a nice addition. So let's start right away with number 10. Shadow of the Tomb Raider with a platinum difficulty 5 out of 10. But for people who have experienced the two previous games the plat difficulty is a 4 out of 10. You have to beat the game on Deadly Obsession, which is the hardest difficulty in the game. It's recommend going for two playthroughs because there's a new game plus, which makes the hardest difficulty a little bit easier. The game has 64 trophies, every trophy can be obtained offline and there are also some DLCs. On number 9 we have Vampire with a platinum difficulty 4 out of 10. You can get all the trophies in a single playthrough using backup saves. Only two backup saves on the right place are needed to get the platinum. There's also an infinite experience glitch which got patched with the latest update. But if you own the physical copy for this game you can delete the patch and still use the glitch. If you own the digital version for this game there's no workaround. The game has 29 offline trophies and you can get the platinum in about 25 hours. Number 8 is also the 8th installment in the God of War franchise and the sequel to God of War 3. For this title they added more RPG elements and changed up the combat system. For some people this is a must have game on Playstation 4 and the good thing about this game is that there is nothing missable so you can enjoy the story and gameplay without thinking too much about the trophies. There are 37 offline trophies and you can play the entire game on easy. This is why I put this game in my top 10 list. Number 7 on my list is Far Cry 5. Far Cry 5 is the 5th entry in the claimed first first shooter open world series from Ubisoft. This time the series takes you to Hope County, Montana where you have to fight against the crazed religious cult. The game has 44 offline trophies and 7 online trophies. There are no missable trophies and you can play the entire game on easy difficulty. The platinum difficulty is a 4 out of 10 and the game should keep you busy between 25 to 30 hours. Number 6 is Battlefield 5. The game takes place in the World War 2. You need to complete the story mode on hardcore, but hardcore isn't difficulty by any means. A few checkpoints may take a few tries, but they are plentiful. The game has 6 offline trophies and 16 online trophies. Don't worry about the online trophies, you don't need to be a first person shooter expert to get the online trophies done. Number 5 on my list is Marvel's Spider-Man. You can just enjoy the game. Anything you don't finish can be completed after you finish the story. The game has 51 offline trophies and you should get the platinum in about 25 hours. At the moment there are also 3 available DLCs where you can earn some extra trophies if you enjoyed the game. Number 4 is The Crew 2. This game is online only and a PS Plus subscription is required to play it. The Crew 2 is probably one of the easiest mainstream racing game platinums on PS4. The game has 35 trophies and no trophies are missable. So sit back and enjoy the ride in this fun game. So we are already on number 3 and it's South Park The Fractured Butthole. It's a sequel to the hugely popular Stick of Truth, which came out on PlayStation 4 and also PlayStation 3. The game is one of the shorter ones in my list. You only should need about 20 hours to get the platinum. The game has 36 offline trophies with a platinum difficulty 3 out of 10. On number 2 we have Spyro Reunited Trilogy. This trilogy contains 3 titles. The first one is Spyro the Dragon with 37 offline trophies. It's also the easiest and fastest from these 3. You can get the platinum in 5 hours. The second one is Spyro 2 Riptor's Rage. With 30 offline trophies, you should get the platinum in about 8 hours. And last but not least, Spyro 3 Year of the Dragon with 41 offline trophies. And you should be able to get the platinum also in about 8 hours. There are also some cheat codes available for these games. Unlimited lives, 
level select, changing colors for your dragon, but you can get through the game easily without these cheat codes. And on number 1 we have the game Detroit Become Human. On PlayStation Trophies you can find a step by step platinum trophy guide for this game which brings the difficulty down to a 2 out of 10. You only need one full playthrough and after that you only have to replay the last few chapters. The game has 49 offline trophies and you should get the platinum in about 25 hours. So guys that's it, I hope this video could help you to find some fun and easy platinums. If you know some other easy AAA platinums please let me know this in the comments. Thanks for watching, see you on my next one.